Hey guys, L7 here. Um, I know Pokemon Go is like the biggest craze right now, and I've been trying to get it for uh, my phone. It is not currently available for download on an Asus Zenfone 2 Laser. Now I know it's not available on the Asus Zenfone 2 because that uses an Intel processor, but the Zenfone 2 Laser uses Qualcomm processors, which should uh, be compatible. This is the Asus Zenfone 2 ZE. I think it's the 551KL, it's like the best version of the um, Zenfone 2 laser, and I'm actually going to be doing a full review on this uh, pretty soon, but I wanted to get this video out, and I haven't had the time, so let me try opening the app, I had to try doing it through an APK uh, source, so allow Pokemon Go to access this device, yes, uh, I guess so, I don't know why, um, yeah. See what happens. If it crashes, I'm just gonna uninstall it. But, it seems like we might be able to get it to work. If anything decides to happen on uh, the Asus Zen Phone 2. It's actually a pretty good phone. I'm really happy with it. I'm just kind of confused as why it's not available on this phone yet. If, um, if you look it up on the Google Play Store app, itself, um, it doesn't show up, but if you look it up on Google Chrome, holy crap, it seems like it might actually work, um, so I'm going to put in my data real quick, and, uh, see what happens. Alright, so the Pokemon Go app works with the Asus Zenfone 2 Laser, I don't understand why, let me show you guys how this works, I'm going to go on Google Chrome, and I'm going to type in Pokemon... Oops. Pokemon Go. There's the app. It's going to show up. A mm -hmm. bunch of stuff about it. And you're going to look for this one, the actual app for the Google Play Store. You're going to click on it. It's going to open up the app, uh, the Google Play Store app. And for some reason, it says your device is not compatible with this version. If you guys don't feel like waiting on an update, I don't understand why. Uh, it's not currently compatible with the Zenfone 2 laser. I understand the regular Zenfone 2 again uses the Intel uh, processors, but the Zenfone 2 laser uses Qualcomm processors which are compatible with this app. Um, so yeah, and notice it mentions it here. You have to have uh, 2 gigs of RAM, which this phone has 3, and then you need to have Android version 4.4 up to 6.0. And I have 6.0. One is my current uh, Android Marshmallow version installed onto this phone. It says compatibil compatibility is not guaranteed for devices with, a oh, well, I have GPS. Um, again, it mentions the Intel Atom processors don't work. And then compatibility with tablet devices is not guaranteed. I don't know why you would use a tablet. Uh, most tablets don't have GPS and, like, um, mobile data. I think a few do, but um, not many. And then um, it even says application may not run on certain devices even if they have the compatible OS version installed. So you can't get it from the Google Play Store. You're going to have to get it from an outside source. Go. Throw it over there. Here you can see the app. I'm going to launch that real quick. It's loading. And then it let me play it a moment ago, so... Um, uh, I guess once I have it going, maybe if you guys want to see a full tutorial, I could do that. I'm trying to not make this video very long, but I just want you guys to know that it does work. Um, and also loads very fast on the Zenfone 2 Laser. Here I am. I'll let that focus. L7 Official. And here I am. Um, apparently there are Pokemon nearby. Um... And then I only have a Squirtle so far. So there's that. This is all you need to get. Oops. Videos now. APK. So hopefully APK Pure. There's APK Mirror. You can use that. Um, look, yeah. Just go on apkpure.com. I know that one's really trusted. Um, and here's the the direct app that you would pretty much get off of the Google Play Store uh, from 
Niantic Incorporated. Uh, it's verified, has good rating, you download it straight from the website. When you go to install it, because um, it's going to say file is downloaded, just hit open, and then you're going to have to change your settings. It's going to, um, you have to change the install from unknown sources. Uh, tell yes, install it, and then go back to that setting and turn it off, just in case. So just download the game and leave it as is. Uh, so the game currently works. I guess if it does officially get released on the Google Play Store for the Asus Zenfone 2 Laser, uninstall it from your mirror copy if you really want to, then download it from the Google Play Store if that makes you feel any better. I don't really think it matters since it's the same verified um, app. I don't know how it, updating it will work, but um, I guess I don't even know when they plan on putting out the next update, but that's pretty much all you have to do to get it updated and installed onto your Asus Zenfone 2 Laser. Uh, if you guys have any issues, leave them in the comment section below, but this is really straightforward and simple. I did this in like two minutes. Just go to this website, download it, install it, and you can play the game. Uh, everything else should be fine. Um, I have T-Mobile, if that helps at all. I, I know this phone's also compatible with AT&T, and um, that's about it guys, so thanks for checking out my video, uh, if this was helpful to you, please give this video a thumbs up so more people can see it, and then if you'd like to see a full review on the Asus Zenfone 2 Laser, uh, I'll be doing that at some point very soon. Also, the new system update for the Asus Zenfone 2 Laser is awesome, uh, just makes the phone so much faster and so much better. Alright, so that's all I got for this video guys, thanks for watching, I'm out.